Track's clear. Let's make a break for it. There's the bus. We're gonna make it. Ah! Hello, children. Have a nice trip. Glad you could drop in. You understand that we, as kids, have to go to school, right? But I've got a whole new story for you today. Get it? You're in a hole. Whole new story. Uh, whole. Oh. Uh, I can see that you want to get right to the good stuff. So let me introduce Juanito, the storytelling one. You're looking a little down today, children. Let me lift your spirits with a tale. Once upon a time, deep in the bowels of the city, there lived an incredible blues band called the Little Pigs Three. They were moody, busy, and slow. As in, could you slow us some money? And he wasn't kidding either. For you see, even though they were the hottest blues band in the land, they were yet undiscovered. But as long as they had their music, they were happy. Until one day... <gasps> it's a wolf! What do we do? <laughs> Should we let him in? Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? Have no fear, Shiesty McShyster is here. I was just driving by and heard you playing. You boys got talent, big talent, but without management, you know where. You can't receive the proper exploitation. You boys want to be exploited, don't you? Uh, of course you do. Just leave everything to me, pigs. You're going to be huge. So, with their new agent, the pigs went out into the world to play their first gig. Here we are, boys, the House of Straw. What is this gig? We're on the outskirts of town. Yeah, the outskirts of the outskirts. Hey, what'd you expect, Carnegie Hall? I'll go arrange things while you pigs set up. It's all set. I'll be back for you boys later. A one, a two, a one, two, three. Hey! Stop your horsing around and get this hay loaded onto Jebediah's wagon. As it turned out, the House of Straw was a feed barn. The pigs' first gig was lifting feed bags and shoveling manure. How'd it go, boys? Not so good, man. We didn't play a single note. My allergies are killing me, and Dizzy got a terrible rash. Well, a gig's a gig. At least you're doing what you love. Grab your gear and let's get going. The following day, Shiesty brought the pigs to their next gig. Here it is, boys. The House of Sticks. You're gonna love it. Well, at least we're on the inskirts of the outskirts of town. Unfortunately, the House of Sticks was a lumber yard, and instead of playing music, the pigs had to do chopping and heavy lifting. Oh, baby. So, how'd it go? Uh, man, not so good. We didn't play one song. We're all filthy and sore, and Dizzy slipped a disc. Don't worry, boys. I've lined us up a gig of a more musical nature. How you guys at moving pianos? <laughs> no, no. Mr. McShyster, this ain't working out like we thought it would, man. I mean, we got into music for, well, the music, man. Oh, that's so typical. You musicians are all alike. A bunch of prima donnas who just want fame and fortune handed to you on a silver platter. You ungrateful swine. Give me a call when you decide to... Grow up. Couldn't we have had this discussion closer to home? After a day and a half of walking, the very tired pigs made it back to the city, where they saw something very strange. A grown man weeping like a teeny weeny baby. Oh, what am I to do? Here I am, the owner of the biggest blues club in all of fairytale land. And I've got no act. What happened, cat? <laughs> Little boy Blue, he was all set to blow his horn, and then he sprayed his lip. Throw the ass. Hey, man, we're a blues band. We'd be glad to lend you a hand. 
Oh, you'd really be helping an influential club owner out of a jam. Soon, the pigs had the joint jumping, and once again, they caught the ear of a certain wolf. You pigs are great! Here's a suitcase full of cash and a record contract. Not so fast! I'm managing these pigs. No way, baby. You left us stranded in the country. What about our contract? We didn't sign any contract. Oh. Uh-huh. Would you like to? No! Let's go, boys! Say, you're that boy blue kid, ain't ya? Yes. Let's get some ice on that lip and do some talking. First thing we gotta do is have you sign a contract. And that is how it really happens. So remember, children, a pig in the band is worth, uh, two in the bush? What the heck is that supposed to mean? Uh, psst. Hey, Goose, someone's coming. Um, oh, oh, would you look at the time? Well, ciao! Ouch! Well, well, well. Destruction of a public sidewalk. That'll be a hefty citation. You know, you kids would know that if you didn't ditch school so much. Hey, hey, that's pretty good. Get it? Ditch, school, ditch. You're in one? Uh... A ditch? Oh, yeah, cartoons!